Hi, what's Lily? Again. Hey, how are you, my princess? This is a special episode, and we want to talk about the basic of drawing with drawing shapes. What? With drawing shapes. I'm going to show you how to draw shapes. Shapes and objects? So we're going to see the object as shapes. Okay, let's go to the studio, and we're going to talk about how to draw shapes. Let's go. What is this? Eraser. Eraser, right? And and what is this? Eraser. Eraser again. And then I'm gonna make this. What is this? Eraser. Eraser. Why? It's already different. Do you guys see it different now? From here, huh? Yeah. From here to. It's the same eraser, but it actually different. What is different? The shape. Is the shape different? Talk about the name of the object. You ignore the shapes. Is that right? Like say, how can you draw the eye? When you talk about the eye, you think about what is the eye? The eye can see things. So one of them What is this? An eye. What is this? An eye. An eye. What is this? An eye. An eye. What is this? An eye. So you actually you ignore the difference. If you only say the name of the object, you cannot draw it. I want you to complete the full sentence. Sphere. Sphere shape. Eraser. Of an eraser, right? So at least you pay attention to the shapes. So today we're going to draw this object. What is this? If you have to give you a name. A pepper, a green pepper. Are you kidding me? When you think about green pepper, I think you can eat it, right? Yeah. It's a fruit, right? Yeah. But can you eat that? No. No. Why not? It's fake. Exactly. So you cannot call that a pepper. You only can call it something look like a pepper. We just ignore the name. We just focus on shapes. Many shapes inside that big shapes, like say some lighter, some darker, right? Some somewhere in the middle. Yeah. Uh, some bigger shape, some smaller shape. So we're gonna start from big shape. Okay, we're gonna see here, and we just say, okay, this is would be look like the shape of the thing, the green thing. And then we're gonna draw the shape down here. That's called the shadow. They catch the shadow. But you cannot actually call the name for this. Just better to go with just the shape. Okay, here there's another shape. So when you draw this shape on the paper, what are you gonna do next? What are you gonna do next? Draw the shapes inside. No, not yet. You want to see? Is this in the best place? Yeah. No. No. So how can you make it better? A little bit left. A little bit to the left. So think about, at this point, you have to think about a little bit to the left. A little bit, is that a little bit to the left. Okay, let's move it a little bit to the left. And here, the shadow also a little bit to the left. Like this. Everything a little bit to the left. So we only focus on the bigger shape. And now, how do you like it? Do we need to make it smaller? Yeah. How small you want to go? A tiny bit more. A little bit smaller. Okay. How small? We're going to make this a little bit smaller. Tell me it's small enough, Lily. Small enough. It's good enough? Yes. So that means the, sh the catch the shadow also smaller. need to be a little bit smaller, right? Is that good enough? Are you sure? Need to be sure there's something over here too. Yep. So all you see two different shapes. What we're we going to do next? We set the value to the shapes. Yes. Which one is darker? The upper shape or lower shape? Upper. Okay, good. Upper. Well, let's just not call the name. It's just upper shape. Okay. The upper shape, darker. Now also we're going to set the value to the lower shape. But you know, 
the upper shape is darker than the lower shape. Get it? Yeah. So shape has values. Okay. Is dark enough? Is the light enough? Yeah. yeah. Okay, let's use the finger to blend it. Ew. And you can wash your finger. Come on, Lily. Okay, here we can blend it a little bit. And you can use different things to blend. You can use the blender, you can use the paper towel, you can use the other materials to blend it. But since I have my finger, I can blend it easier yeah, with the I finger. Don't have fingers. You don't have a finger. Now we have two big shapes here. Darker value here, lighter value down here. They're in the good size, in the good place. The next thing I'm going to do, now I'm going to make the shape a little bit more defined. At the bottom here, has a little darker. And now also here, I'm going to draw, divide it into a smaller shape now. You see this? Down here, a little darker shape. Inside this big shape, this is darker shape. And the top, a little lighter. How you can make it a little lighter? And also here have a little shape over here too. How can you make it a little lighter? Huh? Eraser. Oh, your finger can be eraser too. Like look at here. I use my small uh, uh, finger. Pinky. I can make it a little lighter. But if you make it even lighter, you have to use eraser. Right? Okay, here, a little lighter. There you go. Here has a little lighter. And here a little bit lighter. Now, get it? Yep. Now it divided here also a little lighter, but it's not as light as the top. Do you see that? Yes. I just use my finger. Okay, now over here I also see a smaller shape down here. A little smaller shape down here. It's going to be just a simple drawing. Here has a little shape down here. Too okay. stop it. Okay, bottom over here, a little bit darker. Okay, some smaller shape. And here also uh, has a little darker shape connect to there. You can say the name for that is a stamp. But just the, another shape. It's looking for the shape. Now can you see it is look like a uh, something? What is it? Looks like a pepper. Looks like a pepper. Over here also have another shape. So you can see that in the catch the shadow? Yep. Have another shape here. A little bit darker. Okay, so I'm going to start from here so you can start drawing. I can finish my drawing later. Now you're almost done the big shape. Yes. The big shape is doing good. It's so serious. About how they use the blender. They use the blender the whole side, okay? Not the tip. Okay, let's blend this. Okay, you need to blend it, make it even. This is... The Make example of the tip. Yeah, that's the tip. And you see over here? Okay, look at here. This is should be blend in here. This is not enough charcoal. Give it a little charcoal. And then now. start blend it together. Okay, now it look more like a shadow. Alright, good. And now the edge over here, you have some white gap over here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm attacking you. You're attacking me, huh? What's my blender? What about here? Do you see some shape over here? Can you make the shape a little more? No, you need to use charcoal. So you see the shape? Do you see the oval shape? Now looking for other shape. Looking for this shape, for example. Like this edge over here and move it a little lower and then move it to this side it's not a whole straight line from here to there draw the area draw the shape
the light over there, right? Make the light shake. In my angle, I don't see that. You see a little. Okay. You need to keep stretching, otherwise, can I pick up the charcoal? Like over here. Yeah, you don't care. Right? I don't see that thick. And then you use the charcoal to make that smaller. Okay, find other shape first. You draw this angle. When you draw over here, you draw this angle. Yeah. Right? Go on. And then if you want to take out the valley, you use the eraser or the finger. If you don't like these fingers. Fine tuning edge. Yeah. Then use the eraser to do the line shape, right? Okay. Then mold the eraser to the size that you want, and then just use it as a, a drawing tool pick up the light shape. Look first, okay? Doing that like it's lighter, use an eraser. Darker, use charcoal. But you don't want to overdo it. Pay attention to the shapes. How big is the shape? shape in here and you need to build it in okay not just leave the line there the line is first thing after you put the line you need to fill in the shape you have to do this because you cannot hold it it's too thin so you mold it you mold it like this make it sharp like this sharp okay. hold it this is really sharp. You don't want to make it too skinny, okay? Okay, that's sharp. Sharp. This shape, I think this shape is connected 
from here, coming down here. Do you see that shape like that? Huh? And like this shape, like this. And this side, I think this are definitely a little bit sharper. A little darker too. You see that? I think the drawing is almost done. Right. And here, at the bottom over right here, also darker. This area. Like that, I think. Finish it. Yeah, that was uh, I. I want you to look at this triangle, and there's also here have a little. There's actually a little dark because this shadow, I think, yeah. And then, then the the light coming from here. And then you see the light a little bit open on this side. So I think it's the weirdest drawing I've ever done. Why is it the weirdest drawing you've done? Buttons, coat, no head. The drawing shape. <laughs> now, Loli, what do you think? Now you know how they see shapes, right? Yeah. So hopefully you guys will learn something. So hopefully the subscriber cat would know how to draw now. <laughs> That's right. You're going to know how to draw. I'm going to teach you next. Meow. Meow. Let's see the Pokemon ball. What do you have today? I have no idea. Oh, ooh, that's right. It has an eraser. And that you can use that for the drawing. Cat. Oh. I made this in the second grade. Oh, look at that. In the second grade. Okay, and what's this? A ring made by my friend. It's a ring? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's fun. I hope you guys can drop us some comments and give us suggestions what to do. And remember, please subscribe.